come on in and have some fun. Yeah, it's Bubbly Waffle time. Hi, I am Bubbly Waffle. I'm a variety streamer on Twitch where I do a bunch of stuff generally revolving around cozy stuff, which brings us to our special video, special stream today, which I am just so ecstatic for. Studio Dry Dock reached out to me and I have an early access edition of the game Wildflowers. This game is a standard farming sim, or so you think, because it has a witch twist. And I am just so excited to show it to you all today. Um, it is a cottage core witch type game where you play as the main character, Tara, who just moved to a rural island to help with their grandmother and the family farm. You get to know a memorable cast, which I find this super awesome because this is one of the first farming sims that I've played personally that has a fully voiced cast. It's not a farming sim where you just have to read everything the entire time and just imagine the voices in your head, which don't get me wrong, I do love because I am a fond lover of reading. However, sometimes getting that just extra little touch of what the developers wanted the voices to sound like just totally helps so much more with the immersion. So let's get into Wildflowers. Again, thank you so much Studio Dry Dog for giving me this creator code. I am just so ecstatic. So let's go. Oh my gosh, this game looks so cute. I love the cute little like sprinkle fairy dust on the logo. I love the cabin. Oh, this is just so cute, okay. New game. I am literally gonna cry. This is such a cute game. flying all over. <gasps> Gay flag! LGBTQ! LGBTQIA+. Woo! Represent! And there's like, there's a cute little pigeon and a bird. Okay, the diverse people that I'm already seeing this far is just so awesome. She's so pretty. Excuse me, would you happen to know the way to Hazel Wilde's farm? Tara? Oh my goodness, it really is you, isn't it? Lena? I haven't seen you since I was tiny. It's good to see you again. Oh I gosh. heard you were coming to stay with your grandma, Hazel. Now, do you remember the way? <laughs> uh, no. I don't remember much from that time. No problem. Go up the stairs behind me and turn left at the top. Then just follow your nose till you get to Hazel's house. Go up the stairs behind you, then turn left and follow the path. Got it. Oh my gosh. Okay, and like, I love that there are different body types in this game. Like, look at the main character. And then like, look at this, this person, Lena. I think that's what her name was. I, I'm, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Um, I'm currently playing the game uh, today, Saturday the 17th. The game doesn't actually come out on Steam until the 20th of September. And I am just like, what? This is just so astonishing. Ah, okay, so I need to go left to go find the farm. Jester! Thank you so much for the two gifted subs. You are 
we're officially at 95 gifted subs at this point. Wow. Oh, look it. I love the little... Okay, I love Tara's outfit. I think it is adorable. And this is your grandma's farm? Okay, I know it's like a staple in the farming sim community where you literally have it where you go help your grandparent with the farm. And I just find that such a cute thing because I help my grandpa uh, do some gardening. Because my grandpa was a farmer and his father was a farmer. And Blasted so my grandpa usually break. does a bunch of stuff every year. I ought to blast you. <laughs> Not a bad idea, actually. My charm will bind, turn, and unwind. Oh, is she also a witch? <laughs> ah, look at it go. Uh, Grandma? <gasps> oh, it's you. Oh, my little honeybee. My little honeybee. <laughs> I'm not so little anymore, Grandma. <laughs> no, I suppose not. I'm so glad you've come. Me too. How can I help out around here? I don't know much about farming, but... Maybe you can show me the ropes. Okay, from bud to spud, plant the potato seed in the garden bed by the farm. There now, that should do it. It'll take a few days to grow, but it's a start. This is so cute. Fungus among us. Ah! <laughs> it's the beam! Oh my gosh! There's a fungus among us. <laughs> Grandma has asked for mushrooms in order to make something tasty. Okay, so I need to catch two mushrooms. Catch. I need to forage for two mushrooms. And I need to meet the mayor at town hall in the center of town. So those are my two tasks. I do not have any more seeds, so I can't plant anything. Okay, let's go get the mushrooms first, because mushrooms, mushrooms, mushrooms! Grab the mushrooms. I'm gonna grab this mushroom too. Ooh, what's this? I forged thistle! This makes me so happy. Oh, hello. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. I am Mayor Otto Soft, and you must be the new voter. I mean, neighbor. Uh, hi. Uh, yes, that's, that's me. <laughs> if there is anything you need, I'm the one to speak to. We're a friendly town here at Fairhaven. We want to make sure you're settled in well. To that end, we want you to meet everyone, so we've made it a little game. The that fine so Fairhaven cute. folk will let me know after they've met you. That way, I can give you a prize after you've met everyone. It's really quite clever and progressive. <laughs> Plus a little bit creepy. <laughs> <laughs> you're funny. Anyway, come and see me after you've met everyone. Okay, I need to meet 22 people. Okay, <gasps> look at the cute little sheep drawing. Oh, that is so adorable. I am that Angus. Excuse me? Oh, I could tell you were wondering if you recognized me. I am indeed <laughs> the Angus who was on an episode of Baking Battles. <laughs> Always nice to meet a fan. Oh, yes, I thought that was you. What with this being a, a bakery and all. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I guess it's obvious. My little claim to fame. Oh, I can buy things. <gasps> Blueberry tart, baklava, a Danish, more recipes for bakers. I can buy regular recipes for bakers, banana bread, regular bread, chocolate cupcake, a muffin. Oh, that is so cool. Okay. Okay, I met Angus. Okay. Fairhaven Woods. This is so pretty. 
There's a different type of mushroom. <gasps> mushroom weeping willow. Ah, that looks so cute. I don't think I was supposed to get here yet. Oopsies. Can I get this mushroom? <gasps> a toadstool. And a mandrake. And is this something else? Another mandrake. Let's get this toadstool and this mushroom. Because I'm sure I'm going to need them eventually, right? Right? That's kind of how these type of games work. You just kind of get a bunch of things for a while and then you just end up using them later. At least that's what I think. It could just be that I want to hoard everything because everything's just so cute! No, 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 you are just fine, Nintendo fan forever. You do not have to ever apologize for rambling. Oh, and this is obviously the school, but let's read what it says. Vanessa is the school teacher, it says. I could have gone into the school probably, but it's okay. I actually have a pretty decent amount of energy still. Is this the, the grocery store closed? The grocery store is closed, okay. Have you found any mushrooms? I did find some mushrooms! Will these work? Those are nice plump ones. You're a natural I love forager. Plump mushrooms. When I was I out searching, I came across that life. old mine. You used to tell me that there were goblins inside, remember? <laughs> I told you that, did I? <laughs> it was a, a smart way of keeping a curious little girl out of danger. The wood in the support rotted clean through. Shame. I'm sure there's still perfectly good iron and copper down there. Come back tomorrow and I'll have the mushroom stew prepared. I'm a bit tired just now. Oh, that's so cute. She's making mushroom soup. Potatoes will take a while to grow. Keep watering them. Every day. Oh my god, she's so cute. Okay. Okay, is this my bed? Do I need to eat anything in this game? This is an adorable stove. I better not, just yet. Okay, yep, because I'm not allowed to cook yet. I need to know, I need to learn how to cook. Can I sit? I cannot sit in that chair, so I'm just gonna go to bed. Mm, I'm sleepy. Yes, you are sleepy. <sighs> Ooh, who is that mysterious figure in the cloak? brought us some extra milk while you were out Aww. so i made us a delicious mushroom soup sure to warm our bellies and Thanks, you're man. you're sure it had the right number of uh gills or whatever we're not going to start seeing things or frothing at the mouth oh no <laughs> if i gave you something that made you see things it'd be on purpose a uh, grandma <laughs> oh, <laughs> just kidding honeybee and who is this beautiful creature i see what? i uh what uh i'm tara be hazel's still my gay heart hazel told me her granddaughter was coming to town but didn't mention that she was so lovely oh, thanks <laughs> i'm amira the doctor here in fairhaven i've been taking care of your grandmother oh wow thank you i came as soon as i heard she was sick she's lucky to have such a caring family well i mean to be honest we kind of fell out of touch for a while. I'm trying to make up for lost time. We can't regain lost time. But you're here for her now. That is enough. They are stunning. And that's obviously the doctor. 
They are closed Mondays, Fridays, and Sundays. Checkups and emergency care. Okay. Who else do I need to meet? Um, oh, I kind of got sidetracked and I forgot what I was supposed to be doing. We're gonna go up here. Oh, go this way. I'm gonna go back to my house. My house. Where my grandma lives with me. My house. Where I'm fixing it up for free because we're family. She makes me soup and I am gonna be a witch. That didn't rhyme. <laughs> Are your allergies acting up? Ah, oh, no, it's all the dust in the front room. But sweeping makes my back ache, so I've turned a blind eye for no months now. But that's exactly what I'm here to help with, Grandma. Hmm. Then would you mind showing those dust bunnies the front door? There's a broom in my room you can use. You wait out here. Those dust bunnies have no idea what's coming for them. Whoa! Is that an actual trap door? <gasps> Jeez, Grandma! What are you keeping down there? <gasps> Grandma has so, some secrets. So, the trap door under the rug... Hmm? What is it for? Preserves and pickles? Or old machinery? It's not important, honeybee. Will you be out and about tonight? Probably, but I... Could you fetch me some moonflower? It only blooms after sunset. You'll know it by the white blossoms. See, my moonflower tea blend makes me feel so healthy. I get a blush on these old cheeks. Go right past mm. Parker's workshop into the woods and you'll find what you need. I feel like I'm getting redirected here. I, at my age, it's awfully hard to hear <gasps> certain things. Did you put the rug back in place? Yes, uh, Grandma, but... Uh... But are you brewing moonshine down there? <laughs> you can tell me if you're brewing moonshine. Mm, I can already taste that tea. Ooh. Um, I think this is gonna be a good stopping point for today. Um, I've been playing this game for about an hour thus far, and it is so cute, and I don't want to get completely sucked up and try to beat the whole game in like a day. I don't actually know how long this game will take to quote unquote beat. Um because most farming sims you kind of don't really beat the game it's about like you know restoring the farm and you know uh making it where the villagers are better and like you do events with villagers and you can uh, marry the villagers and stuff like that and i am just so excited for this game thus far it's just it's just so lovely and that ends our first playthrough of Wildflowers. Again, thank you so much for the team over at Studio Dry Dock for giving me early access to this game through my creator key. I am just so grateful for this amazing opportunity. This game is honestly, without a doubt, going to become one of my favorite farming sims. It instantly captured my attention. It is a nice game that combines cottage core with some mystery, with some witchy, with some beautiful diverse characters, as well as an awesome voice cast. Like I am so excited that this is a farming sim where you could actually hear the voices as the developers wanted the voices to be presented and i think that that is something that is pretty unique that i haven't seen in any of the popular farming sims that i've currently played and i am just so excited to look at this game further and be on the lookout for some future videos and some future streams of this game because I will be playing it more in the future and I may or may not be planning a cosplay of a couple of the characters already. And I may or may not be planning a cosplay of a couple of the characters already. And I may or may not be planning a cosplay of a couple of the characters already. So keep your eyes peeled for that later. 
Um, again, this has been Bubbly Waffle. I'm a variety streamer. I hope you have a beautiful day or night, whatever time zone you're in. Remember to take care of yourself and to stay cozy. Bye-bye now. <laughs>